This is The Making of the Atomic Bomb, a book about, well, the making of the first atomic bomb. There is also a picture of it in here, the first atomic bomb. It was exploded in the New Mexico desert during the Trinity test in 1945. The crater it left behind was covered in a green glass-like material that became known as Trinitite. I got my hands on some of this atomic bomb glass and thought I would share some experiments I did with it. Trinitite feels sort of like glass and has a surface covered in what looks to be uh, bubbles. These bubbles become easier to spot under a microscope. Because trinitite was formed during an atomic bomb explosion, it is radioactive, but not as radioactive as one may think. After almost 75 years, all but the most long-lived radionuclides have decayed away. This means that it is radioactive, but not very much. To test how radioactive it is, I used this Geiger counter. This Geiger counter has a windowed tube, an SBT11A, so it can measure alpha, beta, and gamma radiation. A background radiation measurement reveals that my background radiation is at about uh, 30 counts per minute. Now let us measure the trinitite. It stabilizes at a little more than 100 counts per minute, about three times background levels. To find out what was causing the trinitite to be radioactive, I put it in my gamma spectrometer. I let the data collect for a few hours and then remove the trinitite to take a background spectrum. After importing the data to Microsoft Excel and subtracting the background spectrum, we are left with this gamma spectrum. I know, I know, it isn't the prettiest or cleanest spectrum, but we can still make out a few peaks. This one at about 650 to 700 keV is likely from cesium-137, and so is this one at around 30 keV. Cesium-137 is a fission product, so it is probably from the atomic bomb. This peak at about uh, 50 or 60 keV might be from americium-241, another radionuclide we can expect to find after a plutonium-based atomic bomb explosion. And that concludes my video on trinitite atomic bomb glass.